Ah. You know, I haven't always lived like this. Back in the day, <laughs> when I was a young man with more money than matted. <laughs> yeah, I found myself in some places that I normally would never end up in. I wouldn't go there. But you know, you're, you're bound by ties to your career in this and that. <laughs> well, you find yourself in these places. I remember one time, might have been about 2003 or somewhere in there, I was in Auburn Hills, Michigan in the palace in a private box. The women were so beautiful that it was, it was surreal. It was as though I were in the pages of a magazine. In fact, I, I opened up the sliding glass doors in a room full of people and walked out into the stadium myself and stood there looking around in a square of about 100 empty seats at a packed stadium. And I, it blew my mind. Anyway, the women, those women, for a man like me, what am I, five foot three, 180 centimeters, something like that, uh, short. Sure. Curved spine. It's taken me 12 years to stand like this. Don't forget at the time I was, you know. Well, anyway, those beautiful women, they would make it a point while they were on the other side of some room talking to some football player or whoever. They would make it a point to shoot me down from way across the room just with a look for daring to even look in their direction. My job apparently was to keep my eyes on the ground and shut up. So I, after some time, I made it my game to shut down daddy's little princess long before she had a chance to. You know, I got pretty good at it too. I got a sharp tongue. <laughs> anyway. It was kind of funny to hear Cher's side of the story here. So I thought I'd mix it up today. I'll probably mix it up good. Unless we go with our idea. I know my, you know where my mind will be. <laughs> but a hundred tall, slim, long, night gowns. What do they call those things? Evening gowns. Wow! You strutting in the town like y'all slinging a gun, huh? <laughs> Just a small town girl with a big city attitude. Ah, <laughs> uh, honey, are you looking for some trouble tonight? <laughs> well,
your heart away. So come out, baby. Come out, baby. Come out, baby. You know there ain't nothing left to say. You think you knocked me off my feet? You know I'm flat on the floor. Feel my heart is crying mercy and I'm begging for more. enough to be your damn self, but nah, nobody ever does. <laughs> Thank God I wasn't born a big, tall football player, businessman type, you know. Thank God for that. I've seen enough of the world to know that. <laughs> Stupid SOBs anyway. It's like their mama never taught them anything about a woman. Come on now. 